So right now, Japan is facing its most destructive typhoon in decades. With millions under emergency orders, as Typhoon Shanshan hits the southern region. So here's what you need to know. So Japan has issued the highest level alert to more than 5 million people all across Japan after being completely slammed by one of the strongest typhoons in decades. And here's what's happening right now. At least four people have tragically lost their lives and more than 90 people have been injured after the landfall of Typhoon Shanshan. And not only that, but it's left hundreds of thousands of people without power, plunging entire areas into darkness. Now, this isn't just another storm warning. Japan has really hit the panic button on this as news outlets all across Japan are constantly covering this one devastating typhoon. And this is a level 5 alert, which is the highest level there is. And this isn't just like kind of a stay indoors kind of warning. People are being ordered to move to safer locations immediately or to seek higher ground in their homes. Now, after Typhoon Shanshan had made landfall, it did weaken. However, it's still causing a lot of chaos. And now it's pummeling its way north east, bringing torrential rain and causing a massive disruption to transportation services all across Japan. It's extremely hard to imagine what it's really like for those who have experienced this typhoon firsthand. And the scale of this typhoon is absolutely massive. So if you're in Japan right now or someone you know is in Japan, make sure that they're being updated and staying safe. But really, what should you do when something like a typhoon hits? Well, for one thing, you should always know where your evacuation center is. As these evacuation centers have regular supplies, emergency supplies stocked up just in case. And in addition, you'll want to stock up on emergency supplies that'll last you at least a week, which means water and any emergency food that you'll actually like. Personally, my go-to emergency food is either going to be like a cup noodles or some kind of calorie made bar. What do you think of this though? Let me know your comments in the comment section down below. And please like, share, and subscribe to keep updated on current event topics like this. And also, if you're interested in going to Japan, then you want to make a positive first impression, which is why you should check out my free course on how to make a positive and impactful first impression no matter where you go in Japan. And you can check that out completely for free in the description box down below. And until next time, everyone, stay waku waku.